Hey guys, uh, okay, so I'm just going to show you a very mini haul that I've picked up in the charity shop today. Uh, first of all, we'll start with this little guy right here. Uh, this is a Union Reality uh, game controller headset. Didn't know too much about it, but uh, it was bought down from £4.50 to £2.25, which it probably won't focus, but yeah, £2.25. Didn't know much about it. Uh, I've only ever seen one sell uh, auction for a fiver, which isn't great. But to be honest, it's so rare uh, and it gets sold so little. I might just aim high on this because I don't, you know, I've been doing auctions, as you know, uh, for a little bit. But I don't do everything at auction. In, in the case of this, auction clearly doesn't work that well. So I'm going to try and buy it now and say 30 quid and see what happens. Uh, I may be way over the mark, but when you're the only person selling it on eBay, you may as well try. So, that's that one. And next up is this guy here, which is a Challenge 20 Questions. Uh, paid £2.50, as you can see. Uh, on eBay, you're looking at a, between sort of £10 and £15. Uh, £12.99, £13.99 is a good price for this on eBay. On Amazon FBA, you're looking at about £20. Quid. Uh, and that's the cheapest on FBA at the moment. Um, next up is this guy here. Um, on fully boxed with instructions on eBay, you can get about £25 top end. Okay, so there's been people getting about £17.99 to £20. Uh, I paid £2.50. I do apologise if it doesn't really focus, but yeah, £2.50. Um, for some reason, this stood out in my mind recently when I was in there and I saw just the um, the side there, Capricorn Electronic, and I thought, I'm sure, I'm sure this, I'm sure I remember this for some reason, and I must have seen it in a video or a post, which is why YouTube videos and sharing is so important um, because it does help people, uh, and I know there are people out there that don't like sharing, and that's fine, that's all good, but. For me, I like sharing my finds because it may help somebody else out. Now, if you're out there, I'm not saying that I'm the first guy to find this, but if you this is the first time you're seeing this, you know you can go out there and you know it's worth at least 20 quid. So, yeah, that's why I like doing it. But anyway, uh, on Amazon, the cheapest is £33, but there are no FBA sellers. So I'm tempted to send this up there. I'll have to check some sales data. But I'm tempted to send this up there uh, and aim higher for maybe maybe Christmas I might keep hold of it until Christmas but we'll see we'll see this uh yeah good find two pound fifty should should bring back about twenty five pounds as it is complete so let's just uh move this guy out the way uh let's go with this guy next uh this is a ad max board game uh in conjunction with channel four and obviously they must have got Sony's rights to use that but uh, I don't think there's anything else Sony really in there um, and basically it's just a board game much like the logo board game but this was, this was released a while ago now um, as you can tell by the Sony Triniton TV they're advertising on the front um, I paid £2.50 for it top end this can go for £10 to £15 on eBay um, it can also sell for quite cheap like £5 or £6 so yeah it depends how long I want to wait I might just price it a tenner and let that go, as it is quite a heavy box as well. So yeah, but uh, but yeah, it's still ten to fifteen in that if you're willing to wait. So there you go. Um, let's go with some of this media first. Um, got this guy here, Microsoft Flight Simulator 2004. Um, I paid fifty pence each for those two in the same shop. Uh, this is a game, this is, um, well, it's just footage from an air show, but I'm a massive plane nut. So uh, this is um, about £8 on eBay. You can get about 10 to 15 on Amazon, but for some reason this is currently showing as a restricted product. I'm not sure if that's something to do with Microsoft or if it's a glitch or whatever, but I'll, I'll be happy to put this on eBay for £8. I actually have a bit of a bundle uh, or flash simulators anyway, so I could actually bundle it out with that or with those. Uh, this is Farnborough 1990 to 2008, and like I said, it's footage of uh, previous year's air shows. 
Uh, I'm obviously going to give it a watch myself because I love all this stuff. But uh, once I'm done with it, I will set it on. And you can get about £10 on eBay and about about £10 as well on Amazon FBA. So uh, this one I picked up because I haven't actually seen the film myself yet, Interstellar. Um, I paid, this was £2.99. There we go, £2.99, which I thought was pretty good for the Blu-ray. Um, FBA used is about a tenner, so I will, I can still sell it on and make money. But I really just bought it for myself just to watch. Um, and I'll sell it on afterwards. So that's the media. Uh, next up, a couple of games. Uh, this one is a bit hit and miss. Uh, it can go for really quite cheap. Uh, Disney, The Curse of the Pharaoh. But at the same time, if you're willing to wait, you can get about 10 to £15 pounds on this on eBay. Um, I couldn't find it on Amazon. Oh, actually, no, I did find it on Amazon. And they were going for 4 99 FBA on this. So, yeah, some people really trying to shift some of their stock, probably because of the fees coming in. But, um, yeah, it's in great condition now, really good condition. So I'm hopeful for maybe 12 99 something like that on eBay. Uh, oh, yeah, by the way, I paid £2. I'd like to try and uh, make sure you guys know exactly what I pay for this stuff in my charity shops. Uh, this one, I was really pleased with this. This is a Star Wars Labyrinth. Uh, I paid £1.99. Um, really, really happy with this. I'm not sure what year it is. But um, let's have a look. Oh, 2012. So quite new, actually. Yeah, quite new. Um, but, in, but either way, on Amazon FBA, you're looking at about 22, sorry, £25. On eBay, so this, is, this is top end, by the way. On eBay, you're looking at about 20 to 22 pounds as well. Once again, the box is fantastic condition. Uh, no rips, no tears, no, you know, no, nothing's been dented in. So very happy with that. Um, that's 20 quid all day long in my eyes. Buy it now. Auction maybe obviously a bit less, but who knows. And uh, lastly, a few more items here. Let's move these over so you guys can see. Um, first up. We have these glasses. They're four glasses. I did pay up a bit, four pounds ninety-nine. Uh, usually, I pay fifty pence a glass, but I don't know. I just quite liked the idea of having the four glasses. They're all in really good condition. And uh, let me show you the design on some of these. They're basically ace cards on each side. Um, no real markings or anything. Although well, actually, there kind of is. There's a little shield underneath, but I don't know if that really means much. Um, I'm going to aim for £20 on those because similar sets have sold for that. Um, ideal for gaming nights or man caves or even lady caves. Who are, you know, because they are quite... Yeah, you could you could quite happily hold it like that as well. So, yeah. Um, yeah, not bad. I don't usually do glassware and ceramics and stuff anymore because... Well, to, to be honest, I'm absolutely terrible at packing them, it seems. As I had, a, I had a couple of breakages just before Christmas, so. But we'll see. How, we'll see how they go. Um, they might be ideal for someone's gaming night. And lastly, we have these, and this is a. Uh, these are made by Multimax. Uh, this is a Maserati, and as you can see, the doors open. Uh, I'm not even sure how that door opens, but let's have a look. Oh there, there we go. Um, and I've done about the bonnets and stuff. I don't know if they open all the boots, but. Yeah, maybe not. But uh, another door's open, which is pretty good. Um, they're in really nice condition. Uh, you normally get a display case with them, but these obviously don't come with those. Pet a pound. Uh, this was a pound each for those. Really quite heavy uh, die cast models. I've checked eBay. This is a, a Zonda as well, a uh, Pagani Zonda, which is a really nice car. Um, really nice model. Really nice. Uh, if they had been Corgi or, I um, can't remember the other one, Dinky, is it? They may have been worth a bit more, but they're worth about a tenner each uh, as they sit without the case, which is pretty decent because then I pay a pound each. I I'm happy to get 20 back on two. So, yeah, thanks for watching. Uh, it's just a mini haul. You guys know what charity shops can be like. They are hit and miss. Uh, but I feel I've done pretty well. Uh, I hope you guys agree. Um, if you have any comments or if you want to thumb up, thumb down, disagree, agree, whatever you want to guys, whatever you guys want to do, 
all good with me. So thanks for watching and cheers.